Hello everyone, Gideon here, and welcome back to a terrible Pixelmon survival series. It kind of got that name after the first two episodes where I failed horribly. As you can see, we're doing hardcore again. So let's create the new Pixelmon world. Generating. Okay. Oh yeah, and we're in Pixelmon 2.5.1. So it's all new Pokemon. So we've got more to choose from from Gen 1, Gen 2, 2 from Gen 3 and 2 from Gen 4 because we're missing Torchic and the Fire Pig thingy. I can't remember what it's called now. Um, but who to start off with? Because last time we went with Charmander. How about this time we go with one of the new ones? Let's go with Totodile. So welcome to this new world we're in and it's another island. Oh no wait, wait, yeah, we're in another island. Oh great, that's at level 17, can't fight that. Why does it have to be islands? Ooh, new Pidgey texture. Glitching out in the floor. <laughs> Got my reap up there. What level's my reap? Level 8, can't do anything. Abra, teleports away. The light can't do anything with that. Level Pidgey up here, level 14. No, drowsy. Nope. Drowsy. Uh, is there any magic cap in the water? Abra. No, there isn't. Oh, no, not again. Where's the magic cap over there? Tell me it's not in deep water. Please tell me it's not in deep water. And please tell me it's not too high level that it's learn tackle. And I think we've. Yes. Okay. Go! Fight! Scratch! Magic card. Good. As long as you can keep it in shallow water, Total, should be all right. Where's it gone? I can't see it. Oh, yeah, and this is new battle formation with the spinny thing instead of sort of like going all over the place. Oh, good, it's still there. I might actually be able to survive longer this time. No, don't go out into open water. Don't go out into. Oh. Oh wait, coming back. Die in shallow water. Die in shallow water. Yes, on land. Best place. Best place. Die on land. Die on land. Die on land. Yes, we got levels. But that's not all. We've got fish. We have food. It's not such a terrible series after all. But I'm still keeping this. Okay. After this level 12, scratch it to death. Oh, maybe I should Magical. layer it and then it might not take as much of the uh, scratches to get it down to being dead. And oh. fish. There's an Arbok in the background. Magical. So once I've gotten the food, I need to find red apricorns as well as start mining out iron. Oh, there's a power set behind us. Now we don't want to be getting into fights with creatures that can one-shot us. Otherwise we'll be um, in trouble for a little while to say the least. Oh good, he's on that. Don't fall into that hole. See the late level 9. Good, good, good. Where's the fish? There it is. Fish! If I heard another magic app. Oh, he's over there. At level 15, new. No, not touching that. Too high level. No tackle. What I want is monsters that I can beat easily for the moment, gain food, and won't do too much damage. Well, won't do any damage to me. It's down here. Nothing. There's nothing else spawning in this water. Okay, let's move on to uh, 
Ooh, let's grab some mushrooms. Because we can find some brown mushrooms, then we can make mushroom stew as well. Oh, goody food. There's another box nearby. Okay. Let's grab the wood. Yes, Charbok, we know you're there. No, not Charbok, Arbok. Charbok. Sounds really close there. Charbok. Give me, yes. Charbok. Oh, it's right there. Hmm. Well, ooh, there's magic up that way. Saplings, these will do quite nicely. What? Don't go too close to that, because that guy can probably will attack us and destroy us. Ooh, brown mushrooms. Good, 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 good. I think we are going to survive. Now we just need some. Pokeballs to capture some Pokemon. Which means we need Apricorns. Ooh, there's a pink one here. There's a Pidgey around there somewhere, but that doesn't matter too much. Also need some seeds. Now I know Pokemon Ultra Hardcore is probably not anything too drastic since there's no hostile mobs. But actually there are, there are in dungeons because they can spawn from spawners. But in a sense when it gets to night time you're not going to die from being attacked. I'm just going to grab some more food and levels. Leave him a bit. Grab Magikarp. That's a weird Goldie. sound. Goldie. I didn't realise Magic Cap sounds got that deep. Magic Cap. Scratch it. Where'd he go? Magic Cap. It's close by, but I can't see it. Where is it? Oh, there he is. Oh, so he's down there. And scratch it one last time. Level 10. Nice. More fish. I think our survivability rate is gone up, and that's a red boss seeking, which I am not going to fight because it will utterly kill me at the moment. We have no poker centers around, so it's best choice not to mess with them. We'll take these. Okay, which way to go? Ooh, there's pumpkins over there. First things first, let's make an axe. Be chopping these trees down, make, well, chopping these trees down a lot easier. Okay. Let's need an axe and a pickaxe. And take that, wheels. Smudge cap over there. As long as we can get to the tower leveled up quite nicely, we should be alright. Which means we'll be able to defeat Mareeps, take their wall, and be living nicely. Now what's the deal with Tangela at the moment? Because it's level 39, <laughs> mainly. Oh, no, level 18. Not a good one to face against yet. So nothing here. Oh wait, there's magic up there. What level are you, magic up? Level ten. Magic up. Overshot. There we go. Right. Let's leave it first time this time. Both equal levels, so it should be all right. Now, if this is going to be a long series, then. That's quite good, but if I do build up high and fall off, then that's the end of the series. So I need to be careful of cliffs and all the other stuff. 
Uh, ah, over there. Come to me, fish. There we go. There's. I think that's a muck. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a muck, so that's a danger. Ekins is also another danger. It's getting close to night time. So we'll be working in the dark for a bit. Ooh, slime balls. What dropped slime balls? I can't remember. I think it might be Grimer or Muck. I'm not too sure. But with this stuff we might be able to actually build a base soon. Goody. And maybe start mining for uh, diamonds and stuff to make the healing uh, stations and all that. Ooh, lots of magic harp. Let's go after you. Why did I water gun? Water gun's useless against the water person, really. It's also a waste of PP. Goldine. I think PP stands for PowerPoint, I'm not too sure. Goldine. Goldine. How much you have left of the uh, attack anyway. So at least it can be measured. Okay, magic out, time to die. Magical. There we go. Now, whilst Goldine. in between Goldine. the two episodes I have been doing some training in a different world, which I accidentally deleted. But the place was perfect that I found. It was a really big Pokemon center in between a desert biome, a jungle biome, a forest biome, an extreme hills biome. And I had a Squirtle, which was that Blastoise at the time, and thanks to the desert, had plenty of experience, had all the Pokeballs and the Pokeball farm. It was nice, and stay away from me seeking. Did it drop in the thing? No. It's always in there. Time to eat the fish. Start uh, getting some stone in a bit. Start mining. Oh, there's big power sets. Okay, let's try this guy. Hopefully he drops close by. Because at night time it's really, really annoying to try and find fish in the deep sea, uh, uh, deep waters. Okay, scratch it. Magikarp. And again, scratch. Good boy. Ah, it's over there. Slow. Okay, that's a lot of 15 Coffee. magic up down there. We don't want to deal with that. Zubat. Coffee. I guess it's dark enough for them. Tangalas. Got some flesh. No one to be dealing with any gold bats or anything too dangerous at the moment. Coffee. Need to find a Pokemon Center Coffee. as well, close by. I picked up something. Coffee. I don't know what. Um, we are in a swamp bound, so it might be a bit difficult to find it. Magikarp. All you need is a flying Pokemon. It's another thing I haven't seen. I haven't seen Fine. many Apricons apart from this pink Fine. one. Fine. Where are they all? Oop. Magic out right there. More slime balls. Good, good. Uh, but still, not what I'm wanting. Okay, so it's a tundra biome over there. So I'll have a look into that. Hopefully, find something useful. Maybe a Pokemon Center, or maybe. I don't know, a village, if they do spawn over there. Ooh, power sect. Now, if there's nothing too interesting happening in between uh, different parts, then I'll probably cut out a load. There's a Run away, don't want to deal with electric Pokemon. Not with the water Pokemon. Magikarp. Magic out some water. Nice. Ok, 
I don't really want to be running. Nope, too steep at the moment. Swine up. Swine ups? Swine up. Nope. Swine. So, oh no, not another mag Magnemite. He went away. No. Wait, what? Yes. Got away. What's that? Oh, it's a jinx. For some reason, the Magnemite's a bit aggressive this time. Before I could just walk past him. Well, waltz past him, really. <laughs> So we've got an ice rock over there, that's for Eevee, I'm guessing to turn into Glacium when it's happy enough. And we have a bit of lag, so something big spawned here. Um, small pumpkins over there, but that's not what I need. Let's cut down one more tree and then probably I'll cut for a bit and then come back after I've been mining for some stuff. Or I'll start recording when something interesting pops up. Pidgey, I love you 10. I really want a Pokemon Center then I can start battling like crazy and I don't have to worry. But anyway, be back in a second guys. Ooh, I've just found myself a Pokeball. What's in it? Ooh. Got oh, TM. What's this? Frustration. Nice. I finally found it. I found it. It wasn't actually that far away. The Pokeball thing that we found just a moment ago was just over there. We found ourselves a Poke Center. I think this is a large one. Yes, it is. Nice. We have found ourselves a large Poke Center, people! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Whoop, 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 whoop! Okay, I don't think I'll be adding that many uh, Pokemon battle music into this one, but maybe in the next episode. But since we finally found ourselves a uh, nice place to live, it was weed all over there. Love you, level six. I can finally fight you now. Come on, get back here. Get back here. Gotcha. I'll just kill. Ah, oh, forgot to heal. Silly me. I'll just use raise. Rage. Raise. Oh. Easily done and string. Any string who milk tanks. Ghastly. So we've got some fit, uh, some Pixelmon around us, so that's all right. I just need to find a red apricorn, as well as a black and a yellow. I think. Oh no, I've got yellow. I need to find black for the Ultra Balls, and then I need to mine some iron. Ooh, feathers. Or kill Magnemites. Let's see here. Ooh, there we go, speak of the devil. Just turn around and he's right there. Yes, I know I have dirt. Uh, Far-fetched. So this is where we, oh, red. <laughs> Finding everything close by now. Now that I've said it. Now then, that's a wrap for the episode. I couldn't have had it any better myself. We've survived longer this time, there's lava there, don't want to be falling into that. And I'll have to say thank you guys for watching, like, subscribe and comment below, and I hope you enjoyed. So, good bye!